It's day 187. Zaid, the Prophet's secretary. Zaid was an orphan child. Many years ago, he had lost his father. He had no one to take care of him or to provide him with an education. For this reason, he was feeling lonely. The brightness in his eyes was gone because he wanted to be educated and become a great man. He was very intelligent. If he could get a good education, he could do a lot of good for humanity. After the Battle of Badr, the Prophet had found a solution for those children like Zayed who wanted to learn how to read and write, but could not find an opportunity to do so. He demanded that those who were captured during the war teach at least 10 children how to read and write. When they saw freedom at the end of the tunnel, these prisoners did this job with great joy. Zayed was one of these lucky children. In a short period of time, he learned how to read and write. He was very happy. He was thankful to his prophet for providing this opportunity for him. The prophet used to give special attention to children without a father like Zayed. He used to go to them and used to caress their heads. He used to give them pocket money and ask them if they had any problems. It must have been because of the way Zayed's eyes were moving and the signs on his face that Zayed captured the attention of the prophet. He wanted him to have a good education and learn a foreign language. By the help of the foreign language, he was going to learn, Zaid would be able to communicate with people beyond Arabia. This was a great opportunity for Zaid. It might bring him many benefits. Obeying the wishes of the Prophet, Zaid learned a foreign language. The foreign language that he learned was Syriac, which was an important language used in Syria in those days. He mastered the Syrian language completely. He could read and write in it. The Prophet took Zaid to his home. He made him his personal secretary. When he received a letter in the Syrian language, he used to ask Zaid to read it to him. He used to ask him also to reply to that letter. Zaid was very happy with this situation. Because of his habit of hard work and his good memory, he had become the personal secretary to the Prophet and was assumed of success. In a short time, he learned some other foreign languages too. While he was a poor orphan without protection, he had become one of the closest to the Prophet and his greatest helper. Without the love and attention of the Prophet, he could never have achieved this. From then on, Zaid always had a joyful light in his eyes.